hands. <gasps> a few months ago, we featured the story of Tim Saver, a night guard who started a new job at an undisclosed facility. For some reason, no one was willing to work the night shift. And before uh, long, yeah. Tim understood why. Yep, I would not work the night shift, and nope. Disturbing and unexplainable events at work. Eventually, Tim discovered that the source of the strange activity in the building seemed to be coming from an overhead attic space. When Tim went up into the attic to investigate, he discovered something truly horrifying. <sighs> What the shit? It's a hand. What the fuck? <gasps> Even if it's a person, that's so really creepy. Oh, oh, no, no. Since this video, the strange activity in the building has only gotten worse. Tim says that he's actually been attacked by something a few times. So, cut to another late night. Security guard Tim begins to hear banging coming from somewhere in- Oh, I hate banging. I really do. If you've ever seen the film Annabelle, and is it the first part of it? No, no, sorry. Apologies. Not Annabelle. The Conjuring. The Conjuring. And it's the first part of it when they have the Annabelle doll. And she's like with these like nursing students, I'm sure. And then they have her in the room and all this shit goes down. So they thought, they're like, fuck that. We'll get rid of her. And they put her outside and then bye bye in the bin. And then it's like in the dead of night and they're both in their beds and all you hear is the door bang, 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 and like trying to get back in and bang and oh my god, me and my partner, we both hate that kind of shit. Absolutely hate it. And I remember when we um first moved in to our current place and this was like years and years ago and i remember we were in like just chilling this was about like 11 or 12 o'clock at night and we'd only moved in for a couple of weeks at this point and i think we'd recently just like watched like the film or we talked about the film or something like that and we we're just basically just like chatting about the fact it's like banging noises and everything and then somebody was at the door and we didn't have a bell or anything like that and they were banging on the door and we both shat ourselves so we just opened the window i'm like hello and then it Turned out they were at the wrong door, but oh my god, it was horrible, absolutely horrible, and um, no. So we both decided, like together, we're just like, if the door goes at this time of night, we don't answer. We were, we are not in, or we are asleep. No, and it was just we just we both hate that shit, and it's like no. So we both agree on that. We just don't like it. So anytime it's like in a, a horror film, we're both just like sitting there all scared, and it's just like no don't like it it's terrifying so if i was in a place if we were both in like in the situation i don't know i think we'd both cry and run i think we just would grab each other and just run <laughs> that's what would happen let's record as he goes to investigate oh no why 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 don't do that, dude. Even if it's a person, they can harm you. Oh, the fucking mannequins. Oh, I can see, like, why folks don't like them. My partner doesn't like the mannequins either. And I, I get it. I get it. They're creepy as shit. Hello? Hello? Goodbye. Oh my god, what if it answered? What if it turned- Oh! Oh! That moved! That moved! Holy crap. Well, if that got up and turned its head on. Why are you going over, you bizarre fool? Oh, no! Glass! <laughs> no! Dude, don't go over. It's demons. Oh, we're going to have to go back to the, like, fail thing. The fail army soon, because I'm getting terrified of this. Why are you that far in? Who's there? No one. Run. Hello? God damn it, why? Oh no. A mannequin moves on its own and then falls over. Oh my god. As frame falls to the floor and shatters into a million pieces. Tim hears the creepy sound of a woman crying, and finally, oh. a loud raspy voice can be heard from somewhere in the room. You know what, even if this one was a hoax in stage, that is terrifying. Hello? 
That's creepy as shit. And he just makes a run for it. Yeah, for sure. A few weeks later, Tim is back on the night shift when things once again take a terrifying turn. Why? Oh, his fucking hands! <gasps> oh my god! Look at those freaking hands dangling! <gasps> oh, little chubby hands. Chubby arms. Oh, see if they just go woo! <laughs> oh god. Ah! Why? <gasps> Something's gonna come out and it's gonna run. Oh, oh. God damn it, my lord in hell. Get your torch and skedaddle. Why are you in here still? Why? Uh. Oh dude, you're too you're you're too stupid. Oh. oh why are you in here? That's a cross upside down. <gasps> Fucking hell. Someone or something can be seen. Oh, that's a person. No card. You can actually see them. He moves back, and when Tim turns on his flashlight, it just disappears. That was a person. Tim you can see their whole outline of them. Seen while working as a night guard in the building, but this pushed him over the edge. Yeah. The next day, Tim quit his job. I am not surprised. So is it real? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide.